When you enter this bright white sparkling clean manufacturing site, a screeching grinding noise is a bit deafening. While it's not music to anyone's ears, each stitch is the sound of safety. We're looking at every single respirator that's coming off this line. It's not just a mask being produced, but an N95 respirator. The surgical N95 respirator is of the highest bar in terms of the product testing required. And the safest around. Just last week, the product line called Blocks received approval from the National Institute of Occupational Safety for its product. A very rare accolade, meaning when you put this on, you're about as safe as it gets from airborne contaminants and bodily fluids. There's really only a handful that are approved in the U.S. And of that handful, only a half are domestic manufacturers. The company pivoted last year to making the N95s as the pandemic ramped up. When the height of the COVID pandemic, we looked at how we can address an unmet need. They had all the proper tools to get the ball rolling with their first company called IV Watch. I would place the sensor near that IV site. By making sensors to go on patient IVs that detect problems. While they're still churning those out, now they're making 15 to 20,000 N95 respirators a day. This as COVID cases continue to inundate hospitals across the U.S. Something else unique, all the masks are backed by this efficacy testing scanning barcode so you can see just how safe your mask is before putting it on. Making something that is not just so valuable during a pandemic like COVID, but also was a product that was had a market need before and will have a market need after.